delighted to be joined here by a goal scorer on the night, Sam Baird. And Sam, 4 0 to the town. You've a habit of scoring goals against that loan. You must have been delighted to get your own tonight. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Um, and that's every game in the last probably two years. So, yeah, look, it's just important that we got three points. Obviously, um, results went well for us, I suppose, tonight. And it was important that we put three points on the board to keep us, keep us up there. It's been a very good performance against UCD last week, you know. A great win at home, and then you know you wouldn't know what way the game would have went tonight like, coming into you know at Loner and form I suppose two wins on the trough for them, uh, the first time in a year now, and you know we're not in bad form ourselves, but you know it's it's the, it's the derby, it's El Clasico, yeah. you never really know what to expect, especially coming to Athlone Stadium. Yeah. So you must have been delighted to get such an emphatic victory in the end. Yeah, no, definitely. And um, in fairness, Athlone, they're they're a good side. We've seen that in the first game, even in the first twenty minutes, they could have scored a goal or two. Um, and like you said, they're been on a good run of form, so uh, we were running all losers, it's going to be a tough game, but like I said, coming here and getting three points, um, I think the second half were probably very good. First half, um, we still played well, but I think we lifted a lot in the second half, and you see, once, once we kind of get into our show, there's a lot of quality all around the pitch, and uh, we went and beat the point convincingly in the end. We were fairly dominating, I think, in the first and second half, and, and when that long went the man down and, and yeah. conceded, no G, kind of was just you know game over at that stage. But yeah. how good was it from your point of view to see the subs come on and the impact they made? You know, Aaron McNally was tearing down the left. Yeah. Chambo comes on and gets a goal, and, and Aaron McCabe almost gets through as well. Yeah, no, delighted. Um, Aaron McNally's probably had a bit of a tough time lately, and I said to him just there when he came on, just as was a five minutes in the second half, he was absolutely excellent. Um, he's such a good player, he's still only a kid really and he's, he's developing and he's earning but he's a massive future ahead of him and then obviously Chamber, um, everybody in the club knows what Chamber is about and I'm, I'm the happiest man that he's, he got a goal tonight and I'm absolutely delighted for him. You know you've been here before with the club, you're one of our more experienced players now, getting on three years with us. What, what, what do you tell the younger players now going into the end of the season and potentially playoffs ahead? Well look, um, I still wouldn't be able to leg out like in fairness. This league, it's a crazy league, especially this year, I suppose. You see some of the results, teams are beating, like everything to beating everyone, so we, you can never bank on three points, I suppose. So, uh, look, we'll just we'll just take each game as it comes and try and put a good performance in, try and get three points on it. I suppose at this stage of the season, we'll have five games left. It's just about getting three points each week, and then um, whether it's not enough to win the league, we'll, we'll hopefully um, finish as high as we can. And, if it is the playoffs, hopefully get a home drawn in the playoffs. We're going to hold the Galway next week. You know, Galway are one of them teams that always face the challenge and, and they're flying form now under John Caulfield after taking over. How, how do you feel going into that game at home now next week? Oh, look, Galway was a tough game down there in, uh, in Galway a couple of weeks ago. Um, and obviously, since John's come in, he's um, he's transformed them. And, um, look, we all know what John's teams are about, the hard work. And, but in fairness to Galway, they've got a lot, a lot of quality, they've got a lot of good players. So um, we'll have to be our best to get three points.